Hello everybody and welcome to another Minecraft tutorial. My name is Spicy and we are here in our 1.16 tutorial world which is filling up quite quickly I might add uh, to show you a tutorial today. Really quick, really simple, actually our very first redstone tutorial believe it or not. Uh -huh -huh. Uh, but we're here to show you uh, something quick and easy today and that is going to be a flying machine, a super simple flying machine. Uh, so like I said we are here in our 1.16 tutorial world. Uh, we will be making this tutorial world available for download for our tier two patreons um coming up here really really soon once we start getting some of this stuff filled up and everything else we're also going to be doing a couple of uh a couple of other downloads for our uh tier two patreons as well but we're going to work right here today uh, we've been expanding uh but we're going to work right here today and we are going to show you how to build a super simple slime flying machine uh this can be used for clearing crops doing automatic clearing of crops um you could do it for carrot farms, you could do it for potato farms, you could do it for really kind of, I think you could do it for those, but I know for a fact you can do it for sugarcane and bamboo. Uh, it's super simple and uh, really easy to make, very survival friendly, and this is what we're going to need to make it. So if you're in survival, these are the things that you're going to need. So two sticky pistons, two observers, two pieces of obsidian, 12 however many slime blocks you want to make it out. I'm not sure what the limit is on how much you to push, but well, we're going with 12 today. Uh, um, four redstone repeaters, uh, eight pieces of redstone, two levers, 64, well, uh, just some slabs and some building blocks. Um, we're going to go ahead and pull all this stuff down here into our hot bar, and we are going to get started. Okay, guys, so we're going to come right here, and what we're going to do is we're actually, we've already done this, but we're going to pillar ourselves up by two blocks. Now, depending on if you wanted to do like a sugarcane farm or something like that, we'll actually take it back down. We're going to do it by one block. So if you want to do the sugarcane farm, the bottom piece of sugarcane, you don't want to get mined out or anything like that. Or you can use this for gas farms, all kinds of different things. Um, but we're going to take a piece of obsidian and we're going to place it right there. Um, this is going to be the redstone components to make the flying machine go back and forth. So this will go down and come back because we're going to build one just like this on the other side. Um, so you want to take note of where you are. Um, maybe take your coordinates down or something like that and look at what what um what um what's that the uh, z axis that you're on and you're going to want to go so we're at 131 here we want to go over to 132 when we do the one on the other side so uh what we're going to do though is we're going to come right here and we're going to place some slabs down uh we can actually break this out if you wanted to it's not really necessary you'll probably have a hard time getting down there uh but what we want to do is we want to bring some slabs out um and we're going to come out right here we're going to come out one two behind it and then turn to the side and go one two one two and then one just like that um now what we're going to do is we're going to take some redstone and you want to place two pieces of redstone right here you want to grab your repeaters do one facing one way one facing the other doesn't really matter which one they need both need to be on four ticks and then over here we're going to place a piece of redstone a piece of redstone here uh, come on top of this slab place a full block we're going to come up underneath here we're going to bust this slab out uh, it's, it's, it's really better if you have this up a little bit higher, but if not, that's okay. Uh, so, and this right here is it. That is it for your little redstone contraption to send it back and forth. So what we're going to do is we're going to duplicate this over here on the other side. So we've already got our pillar set up. So like I said, you're going to want to go one block over with your obsidian. And we're going to place that block of obsidian right there, just like that. Come down below again. Um, we've got our contraption. Our redstone contraption is going off to this, to the looking at it now to the left side this one we're gonna bring out to the right side so one two blocks back one two one two and one just like that we're gonna come up here with our couple pieces of redstone do do right there uh, repeaters facing opposite directions to make a little clock we're gonna put those on four ticks each and then two more pieces of redstone a full block here we're gonna come down here and bust that out we can do this here you'll have to come down if it's in your world but uh maybe you have to tunnel down a block or something like that to get it to go in but uh we're going to go ahead we're going to take this lever right here and we're going to flip it real quick on and off so now we've got this going on if it's paused if it's solid red you may need to break some redstone out and redo it again or break one of the uh break one of the repeaters out and do it over again but just do it to this one here not the one on the other side just the one on the return side so we're going to go back to the starting side and what we're going to do is we're going to come right here against this obsidian block on the opposite side of where the redstone contraptions are, we're gonna place a sticky piston facing out. And then you're gonna to wanna to put your slime block 
and then you can do two temporary blocks we're going to just go ahead and use the slime here uh, bust this one out right here and turn this way and place an observer facing outwards so when you break this temporary block out you want the face to come out this way now we're going to come around here and right up against that slime block we're going to place another sticky piston facing backwards so facing towards you a slime block again and then we're going to swing back around here to the front and this is very important we are going to shift click onto the repeater with our observer so our face is facing this part right here because it's going to look at this and it's going to say hey i gotta go back the other direction it's going to go back the other direction um, now with with the arms for this to do the sweeping motion you can make these uh like i said is i think as long as i think it's maybe 13 blocks or something that it'll do so including that one 12 more uh, i'm not 100 percent sure on that i'll have to check that and make sure uh, we're going to do ours five so one two three four and five um we're going to do that on each side one two three four and five quick little tutorial we're done pretty much now all we have to do is make this puppy fly so what we're going to do is we're going to come down here we're going to flick this lever real quick just like we did the other one off and on and there we go she's moving she's going to come down she's going to hit against the subsidian and she's going to turn and go back the other way uh, so like I said, this is really great for like sugarcane farms, bamboo farms, things of that nature. Um, it's got a little stutter there at the end and comes back, uh, which is really good. We can use these. We'll be using these in our gas farm that we'll be doing here soon. Uh, you could probably do this with a magma cream farm or a magma cube farm as well. Um, these can be used to move different kinds of mobs and stuff around or whatever, even villagers. If you've got a villager breeder of some sort, you need to scoot them off into one direction. You could probably do it with this too. Um, these things are really, really nice to have in your world. Um, but that is pretty much it, folks. That's that's the tutorial. Um, I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Um, it was It's fun to build. They're simple. They're easy. They're a lot of fun. Um, but yeah, guys. Um, Thanks for being here. Thanks for watching today. If you like the video, give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing so. Uh, we also stream on the Twitch. Uh, the link to that is in our description down below along with our schedule. So, um, yeah, happy building, and we'll see you guys next time. Roses are red. My name is not Dave. This poem makes no sense. Microwave. <laughs>